Let's go watch a movie. Okay. <laughs> um, I'm I'm free later this week. No, I mean now. John, I want to start with you. Your novel is so loved by so many readers. It deals with a very touching love story between two young cancer patients. Were you at all hesitant about turning it into a film? Yeah, I was very hesitant. I mean, I think Hollywood struggles not to tell sentimental stories, particularly when um, it's a serious or challenging uh, circumstance. Um, they often sort of fall into the trap of sentimentalizing those stories. Uh, but uh, the producers of this movie and, and the studio promised that they wouldn't do that, and they kept that promise. So you are pleased with the end result. I'm thrilled or else I wouldn't be here. Right, right. <laughs> no, I am. I'm so lucky. I, I'm so happy. I love, I love the movie. I'm so grateful to everyone who made it because I really do think it honors the story. And yet you had no interest in writing the screenplay, correct? No, no, and I'm a terrible screenwriter. I'm not particularly good at writing plots, um, uh, as critics have pointed out. Um, <laughs> but screenplays are so structural, and uh, novels, for me at least, are so character-driven, and um, they're allowed to be rambling, they're allowed to be kind of discursive, but uh, screenplays aren't. And so I was very, very lucky that uh, Weber and Neustadter, two of the best uh, screenwriters working right now, um, were able to lend structure to the story.